All right, Chrissy crew, we are about to marinate this pot roast, two pound pot roast. And I, wanna, I want y'all to watch me wash this. A lot of people are complaining. I saw this one guy's video on YouTube. And he didn't wash it. <laughs> so I want y'all to witness me washing this. I want y'all to witness me washing this. Turn the camera that way. <laughs> Look at that big old chunk of chunk of. Washing the meat, y'all. Washing the meat. Washing the meat. Cleaning this is very important in the kitchen. Very important. It's a big old piece of meat. I see why it takes hours. We gonna use this uh, container here. Matter of fact, let me rinse the container. <laughs> We're gonna put that big old juicy piece of meat down in there. Yep, look at that meat. Now some of this stuff gonna go in the broth, like the beef stock, the bay leaves, the saison see all this stuff gonna go once i put the get the pot the, the crock pot going so but everything else we finna start shaking in right now red now this is lemon pepper oops <laughs> i'm so clumsy y'all we got Old Bay. Sprinkle some of that. <coughs> Our Dynamic Duo onion powder. <coughs> and I am putting some raw garlic bulbs into our, our pot. But I'm still going to use um, some garlic powder to put directly over into on top of our meat to marinate it <clears throat> i'm doing this literally with one hand y'all garlic powder did obey put that adobo in adobo i love adobo Buttery steakhouse, anything beef, I like to put steak seasoning on. And now, y'all gonna see me put together before y'all very eyes. Get that seasoning on both sides. Y'all gonna see me put together um, this is olive oil, E B O O, Italian dressing, a marinade. So we got our olive oil. And I know that didn't seem like much, but we're gonna put some Worcestershire sauce in it too, but we building our our Italian, our uh Italian dressing first. We got some Italian seasoning. And we're going to put some of this red wine vinegar in next. 